When was the last time you didn't finish a meal? Think about any leftovers that went uneaten or were tossed out. Well, that happens probably more times than you might think, and it's creating quite the mess for landfills. WHS 11's Robert Bradfield spoke to a local nonprofit about the decisions you can make on this Earth Day to help feed those in need. Let's all work to be more intentional about the food that we consume. Dare to Care is challenging you to care about the food you throw away. Stan Sigwald says Earth Day is a good reminder to consider the amount of food that ends up not on your plate, but in the trash. We know we've been trying to make some headway into uh, preventing food waste, especially when there's so many people in our community that are hungry. Dare to Care is part of the Kentucky Association of Food Banks, which started the Farms to Food Banks program in 2011. Any food with blemishes that's turned away by retailers is given to food banks. In its seven years, 15 million pounds of produce has been handed out to nonprofits like Dare to Care. It has uh, been a great boon for the quality of food that we can distribute to families in need. And we know at the same time it's coming from the fields of local farms and helping uh, the local farm economy. But Sigwald says more can be done, which is why he supports this resolution signed by Governor Matt Bevin this year. It requires state agencies to conduct food waste studies and find solutions to donate more food to pantries, soup kitchens and shelters. As a society, we waste a lot and that waste includes the food that we purchase and don't consume. It's estimated each person in the U.S. wastes one pound of food every day, which ends up in landfills, covering 30 million acres every year. Sigwald says it's nothing to be proud of, which is why he wants you to make smarter choices and consider the needs of nonprofits who are often willing to take your donations rather than have you throw food down the drain. I think we'll go a long way to continuing to make our community a great place. In Louisville, Robert Bradfield, WHAS 11 News. Dare to Care does accept unprepared leftover food from various food drives. If you would like to help out or find the nearest location, we provided a link along with this story on whas11.com.